Hey guys, what's up? I know I haven't been out here in a while, but uh, I've been uh, I've been sick and had an upper respiratory infection, which acquired bronchitis on top of that. So uh, trying to get back out here to do something today. We worked on a knife, and uh, I did some video on it, and I lost the first half of that footage. So I'm making this short one today. To add on to that video and I'm gonna post it try to get that posted up to th this evening but uh yeah I worked on a uh, on a on a knife uh, a small knife that I did it's a rebar knife I just just something simple just wanted to get out and do something because I've been cooped up in the house for two weeks uh, but uh that's where we're at so I'm gonna bring you guys along with it the video was from two days ago, so uh, we're going to do some editing on it, and then I'll get it posted, and, 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 and you guys can see it, and let me know what you think about it. So I just want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas, and uh, hope you have safe holidays. Spend some time with your family, because that's important, and uh, we got some things coming up uh, next week. We got a our party at our church that we're going to have on Saturday. This tomorrow, today is Friday, we're going to have that tomorrow on Saturday. Plus my, my oldest son is coming down, him and his family coming down to celebrate Christmas also. So this video will probably be the last one I post until... I might get one, another one in before Christmas, but we'll see. But uh, that's where we're at. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. And like I said, Merry Christmas to you and have a safe holiday. God bless you guys. Hey guys, I came back real quick. I just wanted to show you what I was, what I was talking about, the design of this knife. Okay, well, it starts out, you got the blade here. This is just going to be a, a smaller version of it, but it's going to be bigger than this. The blade is going to probably be about three inches long. And then you'll come back, let's see blade blade and then you'll come back with a, a trail like this and then it's, it's what it's going to do it's going to fold underneath itself and this is going to be your handle this is all going to be different pieces right here if you guys can see that I hope you can see that but that's what it looks like and you'll you'll get a better adjust of it when, once I start forging it out but Let's uh, go ahead and set the camera up, and then we'll get started. All right, guys. What we're going to do is we're going to draw this out of, out of the rebar. I know it's not... Uh, some people think it's not a good knife to make... Metal to make knives out of, but I think it's pretty decent. It has enough content in it, uh, enough carbon content to, to hold an edge. <clears throat> so... We're going to put this in the fire, we're going to heat it up, and we're going to draw the, draw the blade out first, and then we'll draw the handle part of it out afterwards. So, let's get put this in the fire and get started and get it heated up, and I'll get back with you. Point out for the actual 
with us guys all right guys working double duty today get this thing going uh i got my point out on the, on the rebar now i want to start forming the blade part of it so i'm going to flatten
like it is. Come on this back side. Try to draw more of this out. I don't know. I may give up on this one. We'll see. Okay guys, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to drop it so we, so we know where our blade is. And you guys have seen me do this before. Numerous times. Sure you have.
traditional back uh, blacksmith knife. We're just gonna make this rebar knife. It's too hard to draw all this rebar out, and I'm really not up to it after being sick. So that's what we're gonna go with, guys. I apologize for that change, but uh, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm not gonna bring you along for that, but uh, that's where we're at, and then I'll get back with you when I get it all ground up. All right, guys, this is my basic shape. This is what I'm looking at. So I did some grinding on it. I'm gonna put it back in the in the in the forge and try to straighten it out some. It's got it's got a lot of bends in it that don't need to be in there we're gonna flatten the blade out a little bit more we'll get some heat on here and we'll uh i'll show you what i'm doing with that so hang with us the other day i made a uh you guys can see this a uh christmas bell sleigh bell i did a video on it but the video was kind of jacked up so i didn't post it so i'm gonna uh Put a slit on the back side of here so I can put a, put a ribbon on there. That's pretty cool. And what I want to do here, guys, is just straighten the blade out as much as I can. Try to take some of the hammer works out of it.
a little bit of curve in that handle, so I'm going to straighten that out. And I think the rest of it we can grind out. I had started another knife, but I can't... I misplaced the thing, and I can't find it, so... I'm not going to worry about that one. I'll find it. It'll, it'll show up somewhere later. guys all right guys um, sorry I didn't get back with you sooner but uh here's where we're at with the blade here's what we got done so far hope you can see that I think my camera's getting ready to die but uh, I'm gonna put a temper on this and then we'll clean it up and get back with you when we get it all cleaned up and it'll be done these knives don't take very long to do so you guys just hang with us and we'll get back with you in a few minutes hey guys hey this is where i'm at i'm finished with this knife uh turned out pretty decent i believe i believe it's pretty straight straight as i'm gonna get it uh it turns out pretty good i mean i think i think the knife is good let me know what you guys think about it I cleaned it up. It's pretty sharp. I mean, it, it it will cut you. It won't shave yet, but I'll sharpen it up more. But uh, there you go, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the, the come along with that. I hope, and, and I'm sorry for not being out here for a couple weeks. I've been sick, and, and I had the upper respiratory in, infection and bronchitis. And but I do want to wish everybody a merry Christmas. If I if I don't get back on here before Christmas. And I thank you guys for subscribing to my channel, and I thank you for watching my watching my content. Because without you guys, I can't do it. Hope that you guys have a merry, merry Christmas, and put Christ first in everything that you do, because He is the real reason why we celebrate this time of the year. So, with that being said, I hope you guys have a blessed day, and. Catch up with you next time.